Hey everybody, I'm Robert the Zombie Bargain Hunter, and today we're going to be looking into the top 20 most expensive applause toys that have sold on eBay recently. Um, applause is a very old brand. It started in 1966. Um, they did a lot of character toys like uh, Disney, um, Warner Brothers. They didn't, I don't think they did ever did Krusty. <laughs> um, but yeah, a lot of your Burger King, old Burger King toys that you find like in the, the 80s and 90s were done by Applause. So, um, yeah. <laughs> uh, they actually merged with Dakin in around uh, the 90s. So you, if you see Applause Dakin on the tags of Plush, um, that's why. Because they merged with Applause. But unfortunately, in 2004, they went bankrupt and they were bought out by another car toy company. And the other toy company doesn't even use them anymore. But they have thousands and thousands of toys out there. So let's look at them. Let's go. Let's go to the number 20. Uh, number 20 is Jim Henson, The Tale of the Bunny great grandmother <laughs> i don't i've never seen any one of these uh, there's a whole bunch of different bunnies uh bunny puppets like this so uh, make sure you keep an eye out for them see if there's any tags on this guy now yeah, there's a the generic applause uh tag this is the one you will normally see on an applause toy but yeah really nice keep an eye out for the bunny rabbit uh they sell for good money uh, this one sold for $99.99 plus $13.10 shipping. So, yeah, make sure you keep out for <laughs> Look at the little glasses. <laughs> All right, number 19. Uh, this is an Applause Toys Magic Glow Friend Bear. Okay. <laughs> has little stars on its feet and Magic Glow Bear. You can see it like glows green. Mm, kind of ugly. <laughs> uh, kind of looks like my dare, my bear's like dying. <laughs> it's kind of, it kind of turned gang green. Eh, I'm sorry, that looks pretty bad. But anyways, um, if people are looking for it, so keep an eye out for this guy. Uh, you can see he has like a little, um, like a necklace with a star on it. So. If it's just laying around, you will you can recognize it just by the necklace if it still has a necklace. But yeah, it has a little poof of blue on its hair. <laughs> Anyways, uh, this one sold for $115, so make sure you keep an eye out for that one. This is with the box, so probably without the box, you're probably looking at about $90, $80. So. All right, next one, uh, Lion King applause. Uh, this is adult Simba and Nala, so there is this a it doesn't say how tall they are. I'm not sure how tall they are, but yeah, make sure you keep an eye out. Always keep an eye out for Lion King. Lion King does very well. Um, I'm sure they're probably thinking of another movie to come out with for Lion King. I mean, they have the cartoons going out with the Lion Guard and stuff, so those are pretty popular right now. But here's the um, plastic thing that's on a lot of the old applause toys. You can see really nice. Um, they're really nicely made. That's why Applause is so popular. Uh, these they sold for ninety eight dollars. Next one. Uh, this is a fairly odd parent. Wanda, Cosmo, and Timmy. They just coming out with a new. It's like a cartoon live action, I believe, type type thing. So they are just coming back out. So they might start being popular once again. You can see Timmy looks kind of funny. <laughs> uh, there's Cosmo. And of course Wanda. They're all funny looking. They're pretty small if I uh, remember correctly. Let's try to show you the... There's the tag on it. Uh, anyways, uh, the set of three sold for $120. So whether applause or anything else, keep an eye out for the Fairly Odd Parents right now because, like I said, the, the new program is coming out. If it hasn't come out on, I think it's Paramount Plus or something. All right. Uh, Curious George. Uh, let's see. This is... Uh, he is pretty big. <laughs> uh, there's the applause tag right there on his ear. I'm trying to get a close-up of it. Uh, it does not want to. 
But uh, take my word for it. The plaza tag's right there. Let's see, it doesn't say. Does it say how big? Oh, he's 36 inches big. So he's a he's a one big monkey. <laughs> uh, he sold for $79.99 with 44.42 shipping. I don't know how these people come up with these numbers. <laughs> uh, there's the there's that up close of the the regular hand tag that he has. And let's see if I can show the applause tag. There's the applause tag. There you go. <laughs> All right, what's next? Applause Simpson. Oh, okay. So they did make the Simpsons. <laughs> uh, this is a Simpsons Treehouse of Horror. Uh, talking Krusty the Clown Vampire plush. Uh, he sold for a hundred and thirty dollars. Yeah, anything crusty and different other than the the regular crusty doll always look up um there's the applause tag again um yeah look at his face <laughs> that's really cool uh there's a little blue bow that he has and oh it's like a little simpsons keychain on his uh shirt or pants i've never seen that before uh, probably they're all missing from the ones i had right Anyways, uh, as I said, this one sold for 130 bucks. The next one, this is a uh, Teddy Betty Bear Friend, Lamsey Dozy. Oh my God, there's a lot of words here. <laughs> it's a uh, okay. It's this guy. <laughs> it looks like a, like a praying lamb um, that has like a blanket type clothing. I've never seen this guy. Um, has the hard eyes, the hard plastic eyes. Let's see some other pictures. Also, it looks like there's like uh, the Velcro sticks his hands together, so I guess he can pray or not pray. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, this one sold for best offer of $119.99 plus $11.60 shipping. So. Keep your eye out for Teddy, Betty, Bear, Friend, Lamsey, Dozy, whatever. <laughs> Alright, here's another of the Jim Henson, Tale of the Bunny, uh, Picnic Girl. Uh, I think there's a boy too, so keep your eye out for that. Let's see, <laughs> it's got a funny looking face. Or at least uh, the way they took the picture is funny looking. Has like pink little polka dots all over her dress. Let's see if I can show you. There's the applause tag. And it's a puppet. Of course. Um, sold for $124.99 with $13.10 shipping. So make sure you keep an eye out for these bunny rabbits. Uh, another Lion King. This is Simba's Pride Kovu. Uh, uh, one of the hard to find guys. Look at his nose. <laughs> his nose is Big old nose. Uh, let's see his fluffy tail. I wonder how big he is. Uh, oh, it's 15 inches, so not huge, but uh, pretty rare little plush by applause. I like the paws. You can see all the different colored paws right there. Anyways, uh, he sold for $125 with $14.75 shipping. Next one, uh, this is what I know about uh, from Applause, is the Sad Sam. This is where I learned about them. Uh, it was the Sad Sam and Honey, because um, I, I got a bunch of these when I was uh, when I started in Plush. So I was always happy to find them because they always sold for decent money. Even the cheap ones would sell for like $20, $25. So I was always excited to find these guys um, once I learned about them. <laughs> Um, this one says Te Amo and Te Amo. So I guess it's a set of love dogs. Sad Sam Honey Plush Duo Te Amo. Oh, they, they make sound. So these uh, actually make sound. Uh, they are 2004. So one of the last uh, plushes that uh, Applause made before they went into bankruptcy. Uh, this one sold at $129.99. So that's probably why they are worth so much is they're probably one of the last ones that they made before they they stopped making them next one we have uh plus cow stuart moskowitz uh okay <laughs> it looks like a funny looking cow to me 
has a uh, yellow paws, a uh, goofy looking face. <laughs> uh, there, there's the tag again, just a generic applause tag. And it sold for $150 plus $12.65 shipping. So keep your eye out for this funny looking cow. <laughs> uh, Alright, uh, this is the Space Jam, uh, Toon Squad, Lola, and Bugs Bunny. Uh, these, I think, these are the bigger version of them. There are actually smaller versions that I went to, I believe they went to McDonald's. Um, I know I have a bunch of them. I believe they were McDonald's uh, size, but these are the bigger versions. These are the 20-inch versions. Uh, so, keep your eye out for both. Uh, the McDonald's ones don't do as well. Um, but that's because there were just so many of them. But um, you can see the big ones. They sell for a lot of money. This one's the set sold for $149.95 plus $16.10 shipping. So make sure you keep an eye out. I'm not sure if these um, were supposed to have basketballs with them. Um, I know the McDonald's ones do did. But I can't tell if there's like Velcro on the hands. Um, like the McDonald's ones. But yeah. All right, uh, next one. This is a bear, brown bear, faux head, <laughs> soft sculpture wall mount. It's a bear head. <laughs> it's a bear head on a wall. Uh, I can't believe someone wants a bear head on their wall, but hey, teach their own. I mean, people put fish on their wall. There's those talking fish everywhere that was so popular. So <laughs> to each their own, right? Uh, there's a little applause tag. Um, it's just a realistic bear head. It doesn't talk, it doesn't do nothing. But they, people want their bear head on their wall. <laughs> this one sold for $69.99 plus $109.45 shipping. I don't know how people come up with their shipping costs, but okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the next one. Uh, ho Holly Hobby, 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 yeah, I don't know. A plush pillow talk plush super rare hard to find uh, um, I don't remember seeing anyone so I'll take their word for it um, it's just a doll <laughs> I'm not familiar with this doll uh, I do a lot of plush I rarely do um, many dolls unless um, I come across them uh, there's the there's the mark Holly hobby pillow talk Oh, so they spelled the hobby out a different way just so to get the, in case people spell it wrong. But, okay, it's called Holly Hobby Pillow Talk. And it's a doll. And it made some good money. It sold for $199.96, uh, best offer, of course, with $8 shipping. Yeah, at least it has uh, regular shipping. What's next? Uh, Super Mario Brothers applause. There was a ton of these, so I just picked this one. Uh, you can see it's it's a weird looking Mario. It's not the the generic uh, looking Mario. Um, this one is not figure friendly. <laughs> this is a chubbier Mario. Um, he has his bag. The nice shoes. You can see how they made the shoes. Uh, it has the buttons on it. Uh, but yeah, usually Mario has the head and the body and then the feet. This one's kind of like a bowling pin <laughs> so this is a different Mario than what we than what I'm used to and it looks like the the head or the hair is plastic it's not uh, plush so um, oh yeah it does say vinyl head with tag so um, anytime you find a vinyl head Mario make sure you look it up he sold for $250 so Nice find on the vinyl head Mario, and this one has a tag, so you find out one without the tag, you might have to mark it down a little bit, but still going to make some good money on a Mario. Uh, Disney Rescue Rangers uh, from a Uh Again, this is another cartoon that's coming out. Again, I don't know if they just released it or it's going to release, um, but Rescue Rangers is um, just coming out with, a, I believe it's, Paramount Plus. I don't know if it's coming to the, the movie theaters or not, but I know, I believe it's Paramount Plus that's putting it out. And it's these, it's all four of these guys. 
Uh, this one sold for $254.99. And let me just show you all the characters. Uh, that's Monterey. That's Chip. There's Dale. Or opposite. I always get them confused. And who's the girl's name? Uh, is it Gadget? Gadget? <laughs> I don't remember the girl's name. But I remember Monterey, uh, Chip, and Dale, of course. But I guess his name is Gadget. It's too bad that the picture's so blurry. Oh, there you go. That one's not as blurry. But yeah, there's Gadget. The girl in a, like a raincoat or work clothes? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, let's go. Let's keep going. Now this, this, oh, this thing is so hideous. Look at this costumes. I'm sure that the Beatles fans uh, would love these things. But man, these things hurt my eyes. They are <laughs> some ugly plush. Uh, I'm sorry, the Beatles fan. Don't yell at me, but I'm sorry. They, they are super ugly. <laughs> I would not want this in my house. I mean, if I'm selling it and I found them in the wild, yeah, of course. <laughs> but, man, that's ugly. <laughs> you can see there's the tag on it. It's Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts uh, Club Band. I don't know where... There's the applause tag, so it was from the uh, from applause. Okay, whatever. <laughs> the set of four sold for $142.50 with $116.32 uh, shipping. So, person that found these or purchased these made a lot of money on these guys. But, mm, I'm sorry, they're ugly. <laughs> Alright, what's next? Uh, this is a vintage 1989 applause life-size Dalmatian dog. Let's see. Hmm. You can see he's a little bit dirty right there, too. I think they made note of it in the bottom. Yeah. Has some dirty spots, needs repairs, legs seem bent. So if you find one of these perfect, um, you make a lot more money on this guy. But really nice. I've talked about how the uh, um, the life size and the life, the realistic uh, dogs and animals do very well. Uh, see, there's the dirt spots on them. But anyways, uh, this one sold for $199.99 plus $74 shipping. So easily three three fifty for the one if you find perfect ones on these guys. All right, uh, we got another Beatles. At least this one is not as ugly <laughs> as the last one. I mean, they're not pretty, but they're, they're not as ugly as the last one. Uh, you can see they, they all have their the guitars. Nice setup the, the person did. It's like a stage-looking setup uh, for the pictures. Um, they all have their mouths open, oh, except for that one. <laughs> I guess that one's not the singer. Anyways, um, they have their three guitars, all stands, and it's sold for $375.925 shipping. And number one, this is a huge 30-inch Scooby-Doo <laughs> from Applause. Um, people thought I was crazy for listing my Scooby-Doo's that high, but here's proof that they do sell. Uh, this one's actually missing, you can see it's missing the, the Scooby tag right there, so it's not perfect. It has a little crack on his eye, you can see right there. So he could go for a few more dollars um, if you found a perfect one. Yeah, People always think I'm crazy for listing my big plush high. And this is proof they do sell. Well, I show you when I do sell them anyhow. So um, this is uh, Hanna Barbera 1998, uh, sold for $355.93, best offer, with $46.30 shipping. So, Whew. <laughs> well, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, yeah, hope you learned a lot from applause. Please give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And don't fiddle fart around. Get all your listings up. Um, if you know anybody that likes videos like this, go ahead and share it with them. Take care. See you next video. Bye.